Hello, sports fan. This is Steven here with Sports Choice Plus. I'm bringing you a very special breakdown. I'm going to be covering the Tennessee Titans taking on the Miami Dolphins. Before I get right into that, I want to make sure you're subscribed to the YouTube channel so you can get all the updates and all the breakdowns. Without further ado, let's get right into it. The season that we thought the Miami Dolphins were going to have has quickly taken a turn for the worst. You know about Tua. You also know about the backup quarterback getting hit in the chest um, and being out now. Now the Miami Dolphins are searching for a quarterback at the quarterback position. From the standpoint, that game against the Seahawks left them battered and bruised even more than they already were. Um, you're looking at the Packers. The Packers came in and took care of the Tennessee Titans in a revenge game from Malik Willis. Uh, the Titans are disappointing. They made a lot of changes. They spent a lot of money this offseason, and it just has not panned out yet. I don't know what it, whether the quarterback play. I don't know whether it's the play calling. I don't know whether it's the defense. It's just a combination of all three. Um, the Tennessee Titans are off balance, and what I mean by that, they don't look like they're balanced offensively, and they look like when they do get a lead, they're playing up tight. They're playing scared not to lose. Um, so when that comes into play, you have to ask yourself, what's going to reset this team? What's going to get them to re relax? They have a lot of veterans on their team, so I was expecting a lot more. Um, from the standpoint, the defense does look better, but the offense struggles. Against this Miami team with no quarterback, it's tough to say what they're going to be able to do because they don't really have anybody at the quarterback position. Um, nobody that I believe in. So this should this should bode well for the Tennessee Titans being able to take advantage because at least they have the quarterback. Um, I'm picking the Tennessee Titans to win this one. It's because Miami is so down man wise as far as quarterback position wise. Um, I don't think they're going to have anybody that I know of unless it's breaking news and they sign Tom Brady. That's going to be able to get the ball down the field to them quickly and to be able to take advantage of Tariq Hill and Jalen Waddle. Um, so I'm picking the sorry, Finns fans. Um, Titans, get in the comment section. Tell me your prediction. Dolphins, get in the comment section below. And uh, we'll see you on the next episode.